moves too, you know, so the color moves just like a normal wind blows, changes color when it's moving. Different light reflection hits it, so it changes the color. Yeah, I was using the brown, but I was kind of trying to use it sparingly because, like, I didn't mean to open the bag. I got a oh, sniper. That's fine. I got I got a sniper bill that I want to do that with. Just yeah. the color of the I'm, well, I'm going to change this because I was using that yarn. You guys but... just remember when you're doing your bales, if you are going to ju jute them out, to not block your vision. Okay. Yeah. And like when you want it over your rifle, you want an area where you can put it over your and scope. Don't, and don't make it dark because you're already going to have a boonie on, and the boonie's already going to give you kind of a natural shadow, so you got to be careful with that too. And when you're tying a boonie and you got it long, you want it long down here, yeah. you want this all back here to be very light so that the sun can shine through and eliminate the shadow. Very important. Very, very important is to allow light to come in so that it doesn't create that dark surface. You know what I mean? Okay. You're gonna see that hole. Hey, there's that dude right there, bang. But you know, I don't think you're ever gonna get close enough to a sniper if he's really there, but just saying for you, if you was to be in a situation where you're like you're you're trying to hide, prevent detection, maybe you're in an escape and invasion thing, and so and you're you're sitting there looking at them. Like a trained eye can say, well, there's there's a person right there because I can see that dark hole. And that dark hole is not natural in the environment that we're in. And black is not natural either, so get rid of anything you got black. Black yeah. guns are beautiful, but guess what? I paint my, every one of mine. I don't I don't leave them black. It goes for your boots, too, by the way. Yep. Bottom of your boots. The soles. They should be colored. So that when you're laying down on the ground, you don't see that sticking out. Um, black boots are fine if, you, if that's all you got, but just remember, maybe take a burlap sack, pull it over your boot, cinch it to your to your uh, pant, and that way it'll at least conceal it. What about something like that on the back of your veil? Because it's still mesh. What's that? We could do that on something on the back of your veil. It's shiny though. Yeah, it is shiny, isn't it? Yeah, you need to just spray it with paint. This is the best thing I found out from making a boonie out right here. Yeah. all you do. Come around shiny like this. Yeah. Hey, instantly breaks up the silhouette of a human head. What do they call that? This this is a uh, tent repair kit. Yeah. Military tent repair kit. Comes in little pieces like this, so like if you was out and you had to repair your tent out in the field, don't you just put tiny pieces to it? Anybody want to use it? Um you can find it online. Hey, don't be shy. Shout out. <laughs> so, just remember, tans are good to start your base with. Who needed fish line? You need fish line? Yeah, I don't have any. He uh, he gave you guys some right there if you need some. It's green too. It's spider wire, so it it's real strong. Yeah. yeah. It beats the heck out of tying each strand on separately. Like that. There you go. That's multi can. <laughs> I think that's a fifteen or ten ton. Yeah, um, he's got cotton canvas here. Uh, cotton canvas is really good for movement because it, if you guys want to feel it, it slides really well. It's got no friction. They're all multi cam, yeah. so it's not like one color. But it's out. not as durable as, as nylon canvas. Yeah, you guys can have that canvas. I'm gonna I'm gonna get a suit and do it, something like that. Something this, see the see that how yeah. smooth it is. Yeah, that that makes it easier to slide, but it actually wear faster too. So. I think this is cotton canvas too. Yeah, you guys can have that cotton canvas and fishing line. Nylon Cordura canvas is the best to get. It's the stuff that basically everybody's plate carriers are made out of. You know how durable that is. You know what I mean? That's the good stuff to get. And they have it in patterns. You can order it in patterns. 